Ren Okay, so I want to talk about proper magic, all right? So when I say proper magic, I don't mean like this specific thing or that specific thing or you should do it this way or that, okay? That's not what I mean by proper magic. When I say proper magic, there is some things you need to be aware of. And that is what I'm talking about. For instance, these love spells, there are just certain things that you got to be honest with yourself when you're doing spell work. This is why, you know what I'm saying, when the customers come or the clients come and they say, hey, you know what, I need this, I want this, I want that. And I say book a consultation. You have to book a consultation because you have to tell me what the fuck is going on in your situation. Why you need to do that? You need to let me know because <clears throat> spirit can only tell you so much. Because spirit speaks in codes and symbols and things like that. Even when spirit are speaking to you audibly, um, it doesn't come out as um, the way I'm speaking to you all right now. It don't quite sound like that. Like you'll get some words, some phrases, certain things or whatever. You tell it to the person, the person talks to you. That's usually how they go. Spirit been and told us something that triggers you to speak to what Spirit wants us to know about a particular situation. That's why I always tell people to book a consultation. Because while there are cookie cutter spells um, for just regular mundane things, those spells don't oftentimes apply to every situation. Okay, it depends on what the hell your situation is. What you gonna need to do. Or what needs to happen. Now, if you just got a simple situation, you know, you 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 like a, a dude and 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 y'all already good friends or whatever, okay. You want him to ask you out or whatever. That's nothing. But like if you got a situation where fuck I don't know, you married, he got a girlfriend, y'all been secretly dungeon for each other for a long time, but neither one of y'all significant others is privy to knowing that y'all got a, a secret love Jones or some shit going on. You got some complicated ass shit like that. One spell ain't gonna do you, okay? That's one of the spells that you work over and over and over again until, you know what I'm saying, something in your soul tells you, okay, it's cool to not work this no more. You know what I'm saying? Some of that shit you have to repeat and repeat stuff because you got to do energy to move some stuff around. You know what I'm saying? That shit takes, takes time, takes patience, takes energy. All right? <clears throat> so... That's what I mean by proper magic. You can't do a spell for one thing and think, okay, well, yeah, I'm done. No, certain situations require you to do multiple workings for the same situation. Yep, that is a requirement sometimes, unfortunately. I mean, you probably don't want to hear that, but... It is what it is. Another thing. You cannot. You can. Okay. Let me let me make that a disclaimer as well. You can do whatever the fuck you want to do. Okay. Let me just tell you. You can do whatever you want to do. When I say you, you cannot or you can't. What I really am trying to say is. It's not advisable. Okay. It is not advisable. For you to. See all these colors together, and I, I don't know. Hold on, y'all. I gotta go get another foundation. Because I, I mean to find me a foundation that fits my complexion. Y'all see my complexion all weird, but that's okay. Hold on.
It is not advisable for you to do certain things. Now, you got some complicated shit. It needs to be worked. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, and I'm talking about, we talking about uh, people that's been doing this shit for years and years and years. I've never heard a seasoned practitioner say, every spell only needs to be done once. Never heard that because it's not true. It's not true. And as you get to working, now there are a lot of things, a lot of simple mundane, mundane things that can be done, you know, once every blue moon or some shit like that. But most things need uh, to be repeated on some level, okay? I've never heard that come from a seasoned practitioner. And when I say a seasoned practitioner, I mean people that's been, they're considered elderly now, and they still practice. I'm talking about them folks. They never heard them say no shit like that. It's not true. Now, you got these new booties out here. It's all about their money. Get money. Okay. Now, they might tell you some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But, that's not true. Anywho, um, it really just depends on what your situation is. Now, throwing multiple spells up for different shit of the same shit. Does that make sense? Probably don't to a lot of y'all, cause hell, it don't halfway make no sense to me when it get answered, and I'm the damn practitioner. Season shit. So let me tell you what. You got multiple fucking um different spells going on. For the same situation. Instead of just. Picking a struggle. And working on it. You gonna fuck yourself up. What you gonna do is just bind yourself. To your stupidity. And they ain't gonna have nothing to do with the practitioner. It's gonna be all to do with you. See. Certain shit I'm gonna be getting involved with. No. I'm not doing that. You know what I'm saying. I'm not doing that. No, will not happen. Not, no, not, I'm not doing that. And why is that? Because people be doing some of the stupidest ass shit. This is supposed to, we supposed to be working toward a specific thing. And because you ain't got no patience, or you can't wait for your shit to manifest, now you want to go add some other shit to them. And in the midst of this, you probably done got mad at the motherfucker. Now you decide you want to hex them and shit. That's just too much shit to be putting out in the universe. Too much. Hold on. Something's coming to me. Is it Kenya? Thank you. I don't remember which one was the dark one. Oh, crap. Don't don't be laughing and talking about me. I know I ain't the only person that do this. Must conserve everything. <laughs> this brown, like, I'm looking for that dark. It's got to be this one. We're going to add a little bit of this in there for the rest of my face. <clears throat> I'm light in some places and dark in others. It makes it really difficult for me to find a decent thing. Anyway, you out here put multiple shit out into the universe. Baby, let me tell you something. When that shit... Returns, it's going to be a convoluted motherfucking mess. And then you're going to be sitting there wondering what the fuck went wrong. Why is you doing all that? That be the question. Why the fuck is you doing all that? Why you couldn't just cast your fucking spell, cast your work, and whatever the hell it is you did, and leave it the fuck alone, huh? Why you couldn't just do that? 
Why you had to keep fucking with shit? You know how you fuck with something, fuck with something, fuck with something? Say you created something. You created it, and you fucked with it, and fucked with it, and fucked with it, and fucked with it so much till you just fucked it all up. See, it's kind of like that. You just keep putting this shit out there. Keep putting it out there. And then, next time you look up to actually see what the fuck you doing, you done created all kind of bullshit. Mm-mm. Don't be doing that. That's not how they work. Oh. Um, now, this was the first. And I don't know if this client gonna watch this video or not, but yes, bitch, I'm talking about you. <sighs> Let me tell you something. When I'm doing your work, <clears throat> your work, Sits upon an altar or a specific place in my spirit room. Depends on what the fuck your work is. And once I am done with your work, I can either A, send you your work, or B, discard your work. It really depends on what your case is, what your situation is, and, you know, how spirit tell me to handle you. That's what happens. No, I will not keep your work in my house. No. No, 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 no. See, I am in the shit with you. While I am doing your work. I'm in the shit with you. Because see what y'all don't understand. And what you don't realize. Is a lot of y'all shit. Be transferring. Spilling over. Into other people's lives and shit. Which is one reason why. I need to get my little temple together. <clears throat> okay. And get my little temple together. My little. Um, place out in the, the, the goddamn. Unknown woods. Hell, I want to be like one of my, uh, my friends, ain't it? Shit. Motherfucker, you got to go through the woods, hop on a boat, row the boat across the river with the alligators and, and crocodiles and shit in it. Yeah, row, row the boat. Over oh, across the river, walk through some more woods to get to her goddamn house. That's, that's how I'm trying to be. It's, you have to come find me. That's how I'm trying to be because I just it's just too much fucking bullshit out here and people listening to nonsense and bullshit like y'all tainting up the practice with this nonsense. Okay, shit is serious. This ain't no motherfucking game. Anyway, you can't do shit like that. You, you creating. Mess for yourself, but you know, some people need messes for themselves because they ain't gonna listen no way. Some people need this shit. I probably shouldn't put that one on right now. Oh, well, but I did. <sighs> but yes, you don't need to do that shit. That first of all, that's crazy. You just, just gonna keep throwing shit out there. Well. Let's see what this do. And let's see what this do. And let's try this. First of all, let me tell you something. If the first word when you doing something is let's try it, you, no, fuck. No. You don't need to do it. Because first and foremost, you got to believe in the work that you are putting out there. And you know, a lot of the stuff that I be addressing and I'm getting into, it be people that really don't practice. It be people that are fascinated with magic. They don't really practice magic because some of the shit that people ask for and some of the shit that people say, you know they ain't got no magic practice or they just a dark ass motherfucker and they, they, they gonna let your green ass um reap the, the consequences of the, the shit they trying to get you to do. Yeah, people play like that out in these spiritual streets. But, um, some of the shit people ask, it is clear you have no training. 
and magic, the, the knowledge of self. Clean that shit. With the, the, the shit that I be getting hands for the shit people say. And then some of y'all, boy, like, some people, they be, uh, I think that's it. It's the one I'm looking for. I'm like, what the fuck is she doing? Highlight in my jawline. I got a strong ass jawline. I think it defines my unique beauty, and I'll be trying to highlight that motherfucker when I can. Another reason I try to, you know, make it pronounced is because it helps eat this fat down. <laughs> it helps conceal the fat under my chin. Or it look like I'm about to have three, 12, 15 chins. Mm-hmm. Um, what else? What am I doing? I don't have no water. I didn't put no primer on this. Mm-mm-mm. I might go back and put primer on top of this foundation after I get that. But, yeah, it is clear that a lot of people that pay people to do their work are not actual practitioners themselves. Therefore... They want somebody to do this crazy ass shit for them because they don't really understand what the shit about themselves. They don't know. They just in a desperate situation. And while there are many, and I mean many, they were there are many practitioners. Even other practitioners. You see this shit in the mundane world. Like that uh roll. El Kunto or whatever the fuck her name is, chick. There are many practitioners that will take advantage of your desperateness. There's a whole lot of, lots of them. Lots of them. They will take advantage of your shit. And, you know, And just it keep extracting and extracting and extracting and extracting. And let me tell you something. We got to eat too. So I ain't mad at them. And me. I'll tell y'all some shit. Before. Even if that means my answer to you ain't going to be what you like. Which may result in you not getting the work done. I'm going to tell you the truth. About everything I see. <laughs> but that's just me. That's how I roll. Other people will take advantage of y'all ass. They really will. Not everybody. Some great ones out here. But yeah, a lot of people will take advantage of y'all. Look at me, I look pale as hell. Look like I want to be starting something. <laughs> okay. Look, my fuck around just go outside like this. I'm still not quite feeling this color, so let's see. Where are you? Where are you at? Where that dark one? I think it's Campala. Anyway. No, that is brown. What is this? Oh, Kenya. This might be the one. Damn DNA did say. 
him from somewhere in the east. So let us try this one. See how this works. Oh, hell yeah. That's a whole lot better. Put some color in my face. Got me up here looking like a ghost. This shit can be ghosted. Okay. I don't forgot what the hell I was talking to y'all about and got all engrossed in my little makeup. Um Yeah, I was just telling y'all don't be throwing magic out like that. And no, I'm not keeping your work in my house. The fuck is wrong with y'all? If I do something that you got to sit in your motherfucking house, cause that's what the spirit said, that shit is gonna sit in your motherfucking house. It's not gonna sit in mine. The fuck? Have y'all not 100% honest anyway? I don't find out a lot of shit until I get in there and start doing the work, which is why it's not smart to do work without doing some divination. We be talking about reading suck. Yeah, it do suck to sit up there and read people. It does. Shit is aggravating as hell. At the same time, we would already know most motherfuckers is not going to give you the 100% up and up. They don't let you know whether or not you should even go in there and play in that shit. Okay? So, no. You can't leave your work sitting in my motherfucking house. I got children that live here. Hell wrong with y'all. Some shit's just a no, goddammit. They're all like, what the hell is she doing, baby? Nothing. I ain't doing shit. When I get done with it, it'll be lit. I hope. <laughs> It's right here. Well, that's two. Now I want to put this right here. Just put this big old globe right here. That's what I'm doing. This knee right there. I'm looking crazy. Anyway, yeah, I'm not keeping your fucking work in my house. You lost your damn mind. Like, I don't... Yo, I don't know whether it's this retrograde or what, but I have been getting in some of the craziest ass shit. I've talked to other practitioners, too. Same shit been happening to them. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck going on. It's got to do with this retrograde... Not retrograde. I know. I think I can't remember. I think it had already came out of retrograde. Now I ain't never uh forgot to put primer on my face before. So we is this primer. Yeah, so we don't see what happened. <laughs> this is an experiment. Oh, okay. Oh, that's not too bad. Not too bad. I mean, he moved that shit up there around. But, well, you know, not too bad. Hopefully, it don't crack and help it stay. But let's go ahead and uh, smooth this back out. 
blend and blend and blend. I'm gonna do some more work over here because you can still see that. But that's all right. Damn, because today is, um, what is it? It's Tuesday, so it's more today. I wish I was streaming, cause this is like a stream video. You got to actually come and talk to me while I did this shit. Cause in case y'all haven't noticed me, don't you know what the fuck I'm doing? I already told y'all that. It's gonna come out. La 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 la. <laughs> okay, so black. I don't think I need. I kind of like that red. This one. But. It's slightly off. Look, it don't make no sense. Some people have their palettes memorized. I am not one of those people. Okay? I'm not one of those people. I wonder how crazy I'm going to look. Because I didn't do much contouring or not any contouring that make any sense. We'll see. We will see when we get there. See we get there. Okay, so what am I looking for? Do I need to do my eyes? Lips. No, lips is last. So I guess we you fuck around with the eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and get off and I don't know. My daughter getting ready to come in here and do her schoolwork, so I don't know. Maybe I just go live on Instagram. 